Castle Park, the Government of Japan's pre-training centre. Uh, we're based in uh, Japan in Hokkaido, uh, the most northern of uh, Japanese uh, islands. Uh, actually, uh, as a line of latitude, we're on 42 degrees, uh, which is uh, much further south than somewhere like Dublin, for example, we're 10 degrees further south. It's about the same line of latitude as uh, Rome, for example. Uh, but our climate is entirely different, uh, and whereas uh, the Gulf Stream keeps Europe warm in the wintertime, we don't have the Gulf Stream, and we have almost an opposing force, which are very cold winds uh, coming in from Siberia uh, in the winter. That means that we have cold, snowy, icy winters, and uh, from uh, November until basically end of April, uh, we have ice and snow, and we have snow on the ground for about four months, four months of the year, continuously. Consequently, if we're pre-training, you need to have covered facilities. Um, and we have a number of covered facilities here. Uh, we have one gallop, which is a, we call the donut, which is a round gallop, flat sand surface. Uh, that's about 500 meters, and uh, that's kind of a, just a hacking, uh, trotting, walking uh, arena. And we also have a much longer facility, uh, which is a seven furlong uh, covered uphill ride. Uh, surface there is, is wood chip, uh, and that has a, a constant incline from bottom to top of 3.4%. An incline of 3.4%. Uh, going, we have a, an arena at the bottom and a, another uh, collecting arena at the top. Uh, and from wall to wall, it's uh, 1,400 metres, seven portals. Uh, good often are having a lot of uh, uh, recent success in Japan. Uh, of course, it's down to our staff and to our horses and to our trainers. But uh, we believe our investment in this facility is, is part of that success. And uh, uh, last year, as you mentioned, uh, Godolphin Japan had uh, 100 JRA winners, in, uh, more than 100 actually, I think it was about 107. And uh, this is the first time in the history of Japanese racing that an individual owner, not a club, that an individual owner has had more than uh, 100 uh, JRA wins uh, and uh, racetrack earnings of about 30 million US dollars. So yes, it's, it's, uh, it's doing well, thankfully. Uh, we've had um, a number of uh, Group 1 winners, including Fine Needle, who was champion. Uh, he was champion sprinter miler a dual Group 1 winner, um, and he's the only horse in Japanese history as a sprinter to win four group races in a single year. He was uh, pre-trained here. Uh, another horse that come off this facility is Tower of London. Uh, he's a Group 1 winner last year, and also set two new course records uh, I, in, in Japan in greatest stakes races. <laughs> in greatest stakes races, and uh, he was pre-trained here as well. So yes, we're having uh, we're having some success, thankfully. Credit to our staff uh, and to our horses uh, and to uh, these facilities. And of course, we're a global organisation. Uh, and it should be pointed out that uh, Tower of London, uh, even though he was born in Japan, he's actually by one of our European-based sires. Uh, Ravens Pass, who stands in Kildangan in Ireland. Uh, Fine Needle was in a homebred here in Japan by uh, Admire Moon, uh, who won the Japan Cup in uh, Sheikh Mohammed's colours. So he, he is uh, William Balding, the pre training the manager in Dolphin in Japan. So, this is the second season you start using, yes, using this uh, roofed up here get up. Correct. Yeah. Uh, how do you find this, William? Oh, it's been been terrific uh, help to us. You know, uh, I think we condition the horses better. We've got no hold up with weather. We can train them every day. The surface is very good. It's safe. Uh, it rides like good, good turf. You know, takes all the nature, but it's very, very happy with it. Sugasan, do you want to say a comment in English? Happy. Hi, Smile. William.
Happy? Good. Good man. Medina?